Also at this noon time, a man appearing in court today arrested in connection with the death of his estranged wife after the couple had separated and she was living in Providence with her four children. Eyewitness News reporter Jared Pliner is working the details now live in Providence. That's right, Danielle. Good afternoon. A sole count of murder here. This very brief appearance after his arrest yesterday and the police interrogation. The estranged husband of this woman, Mani Riho and Kina Mubanzi, appears in court charged in her killing, identifying himself to the judge initially by his first name. 46 year old Bosco Tukamuhabwa speaking through a translator, his attorney asking the judge not to read the facts, but family and friends tell us the 44 year old mother of four, who'd moved here from the Congo not too long ago, was found dead in a closet of her Ontario Street home Friday. They say Enkina Mubanzi had recently separated from her husband, filing a no contact order against him. Family and friends say he continued to threaten her. The judge Thursday mentioning domestic charges against Tukumuhabwa from April. A misdemeanor domestic assault and refusal to allow someone to use the telephone line. Domestic charge where you promise to keep the peace and be of good behavior. This new deadly case said to be a violation of that pledge. And in just several days, a fundraising page set up to support the four children in all of this. Well, it has already raised nearly 16 grand of a $20,000 goal. Outside District Court in Providence this noontime, Jared Pliner, Eyewitness News.